What's up guys, happy Friday. Thank you for tuning in to another Friday Fuel Up. We're gonna take you from 89 octane to 93 octane with a little finance tip or sales tip. I appreciate you tuning in. Please make sure to like below, leave me a comment. If you don't mind, share the post. I want other people to hear this message. I wanna help other people and reach other people and I need your help to do it. Today, we're gonna to talk about big changes the way the mortgage industry calculates credit scores. So currently right now, we look at all three bureaus. We look at Equifax, Experian, and TransUnion. And if there's two borrowers, we pull their three scores also. And so what we do is we go by the median or the middle score. Well, moving forward, what the mortgage industry is going to be doing in a recent huge change is we're going to be taking the average of the two. So let's say one person has a really high credit score. Maybe the wife has a 780. And then maybe the husband's middle score is a 680. Currently, we would go off the 680. We have to go off the lower of the two scores. Moving forward into the end of the year and going into 2022, we are now going to start averaging it. So, all right, guys, it made sense for you to marry up and get that wife that had that great credit score. All you guys out there that didn't pay the bills and had really, really low credit scores, you may be able to buy a house now. So if you have questions about this, if you wanna work on your credit, in all seriousness, I'm always here to help you out. Send me a DM, send me a message, contact info is below. Feel free to even call me. I'll be happy to set up a consultation or a phone call and give you some free advice. Hope you guys have a great Friday. Make sure to go fuel up.